Ah, yes, it's that time of year again where we get to build a police set. I don't think I've done any police sets. Uh, 30346, 5 to 12, 46 pieces. It's some kind of biplane that can land on water and has a man in it. So that's that's the thing that people want to see me build, right? So this is a really fun scent because you get you get some good spare pieces. You get uh, robot arm, handcuffs, that smooth brown piece that they use for the light on the front here. So this is the actual build. Propeller use propel. Probably wouldn't spin the same way, but build's kind of it's kind of large actually considering it's not. I don't I don't know what you would expect I guess because I mean like here's here's that city police truck I did a while back it's teeny compared to it and it does have room for a guy of course and he has to be able to fit into the cockpit and you know not be sitting out completely from behind the windscreen it does leave his arms a little exposed but whatever walkie-talkie on the side handcuffs in case he wants to handcuff himself or you know someone else you have because there's no one else in the set to handcuff so looks like it could fly <laughs> kind of worked <laughs> yeah, they work that's, that's what that's what propellers are supposed to do right let's uh, take a quick look at the guy and we'll be done you guys can go on with your lives come back tomorrow and see another video or something so there's the face printing it's, um, I don't know what, uh, just a smug look, I guess is the overall theme of that face. The glasses are nice. You got, um, a badge, maybe a name badge, some zippers, a little map, is that a little map on his legs? It's fun. And, uh, he does have some back printing, but it's very subtle, it's mostly black. Doesn't really add a ton, you know. Not uh, not like you know some some people's back printing. So that's it. You guys made it through another video. Comment if you uh, can think of a good name for it, because it's probably just going to be a spooky seaplane. See ya.